A new breakthrough for a common knee injury that allows the body to heal itself and enables patients to avoid painful reconstructive surgery. CBS 3 health reporter Stephanie Stahl is here to explain how it works. Hi, Stephanie. Hi, Jessica. This is a collagen implant that's used to treat and repair torn ACLs. That's a ligament in the knee. They're often injured during sporting activities. I just felt it go. 20 year old Phoebe Anderson was playing rugby at University of California, San Diego when she tore her ACL, the anterior cruciate ligament. It wasn't painful, but it just felt like it ripped. It's become a common sports injury, especially among young females. There are 400,000 yearly ACL tears in the U.S. that are traditionally repaired with reconstructive surgery using a graft. I was like, I need to get surgery, like immediately. Instead, she found an alternative with a South Jersey doctor. You come all the way across the country for this. His expertise in like sports medicine was like, that was a big driving factor for me, especially as like a student athlete. Dr. Sean McMillan with Virtual Orthopedics is using an implant called Bear to repair torn ACLs. It's a collagen implant that allows for the body to sort of harness its natural healing potential. The implant is placed between the torn ACL and then infused with the patient's own blood. Over time, as the ACL grows back together, the implant is absorbed and disappears. It acts like a scaffold to let the body regenerate. Phoebe was Dr. McMillan. Millen's first patient to get the implant. It just makes more sense naturally to like heal the body part rather than replace it. Three months after getting the implant, Phoebe is regaining her strength back in California in physical therapy. It's not like the other knee, but it's pretty good. I'm out of my brace. This is my brace. Dr. McMillan says recovery with the implant is less painful and it could also have other more long term benefits. We hear a lot of athletes lose their careers as arthritis creeps in. This may be an alternative to keep that arthritis away. And that implant is the first one FDA approved to be able to treat torn ACLs. Jessica? All right, Stephanie, thank you.